All right, let's uh, let's bring back our music guest for the interview, Mr. Adam Wood. Come on up here. <laughs> This is a California lifestyle, haven't you? I have. I guess you're probably probably wearing that book when you're living in Oregon, though, too. So like yes, that. every day. You're full on West Coast wear. In the snow. <laughs> Actually, you know, when I was uh, when I was 18, I moved from uh, uh, 18 or 19, I moved from Maine to Santa Cruz, mm. and had my first you know, like warm winter of my life, and um, I went for about a year barefoot. Really? Yeah. I actually carried a bag with some with some flip flops in them in case I went into a restaurant or something like that. Like a fanny pack. <laughs> like a little fanny pack? I just know it's more like a man purse. Okay. <laughs> not suitable for my son. Oh, yeah. I should know this is in Santa Cruz, though. Oh, yeah, that's right. So, um, so, so how are you doing? I'm good, yeah. I'm real good. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah now, um, uh, most people probably don't know, Adam is actually on a reality show that is currently running. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> reality TV, come on. Here we go. Now, what's the name of the reality show? Uh, it's called 13 Fear is Real. Okay. <laughs> and uh, what channel is that on? Uh, CW, Channel 5. CW. Yeah. Quality. Yeah, quality. And, <laughs> now, what's the, what's the, uh, the premise of the, uh, the show? Uh, basically, 13 people go into the woods uh, in Louisiana, and um, you're just you're scared beyond your, your biggest fears. So they put you through various scary situations, Yeah. and those who Die? <laughs> yeah. You go. It's it's similar to Survivor in a sense because you go through these uh, rituals and executions, and uh, the rituals are anywhere from, you know, trying to save your own your own butt in a, in a boat by bailing the water out so you don't mm -hmm. you know so you don't sink in, in uh, alligator infested waters. Um, yeah, it's it's insane. <laughs> I don't even know. I mean, it was crazy. They don't feed you. You don't get any sleep. Really? So your head just starts to go. No, where was the shot? Louisiana. So there's like lots of bugs everywhere too. All it's the time. like 180 degrees, <laughs> constantly <laughs> dripping sweat. That's pretty hot. And you can't, you can't sleep because it's so hot. Uh -huh. um, and uh, there's like, you're constantly looking at that mosquito and you're like, in your, in your neck. It's like this big, just <laughs> trying to get you the whole time. Does he get you? Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> He's determined oh, yeah. to lose yeah. So, but it, it was fun. I learned a lot, and it's reality television. But whatever. Now, were you ever actually afraid for your life at any point, or was it just like, oh, this is scary, but I know the producers are going to come in and not let me actually get hurt? No, there's always that sense of like knowing that that you've got this full crew there filming, and, and if anything goes wrong, anyone can can come in and save you. But you know, when your biggest fear is, is drowning or, or being burned alive, like you know, that has a huge, huge effect on you. So when you're in a room and, and you know, you're, there's fire all around you, mm -hmm. like, you flip out. Like, okay. I mean, you really <laughs> flip out. Like, everything goes away that's around you except for that fire and you. Mm -hmm. So it's it's a little intense. Okay. Yeah. I actually watched one of the episodes this afternoon. I t voted it the other night. Nice. You saw you, the second episode. I saw the second episode. I, yes. I saw you leave her behind. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good choice. <laughs> that was a really good choice. <laughs> Otherwise... You would have been cut, or you would have been. Yeah, I mean, you. that's another person to vote against later. Okay. Talk about how she's your best friend. Is like, uh -uh, I'm not your yeah, best friend. Yeah, see <laughs> Best friend. <laughs> no, you were so calm through the whole thing. Had I not, had I, had I not met you and known that you were this mellow all the time, I would have expected, you know, that guy, he's too calm. He must, something's up. Something. He's, the, he's the killer. He's so like that's that. all in your head. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, so now you've only been in town for about five months, six months yeah, now. Yeah, five months. Moved here from Seattle, lived in Oregon before that. Yeah. And um, uh, so you've got a you've got a, a pretty a pretty cool gig coming up in a few weeks. You mentioned. Yeah, the whiskey. Yeah, yeah. Whiskey. Uh, it's January twenty second at eight p.m. So you guys better be there. <laughs> Every one of you. Okay. I'm writing all your names down right now. <laughs> Do it. Uh, and it's a, it's a full band. I'll have my full band there, and uh, it's basically like country folk rock. It's, it's good stuff. It's really good stuff. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, cool. Yeah. I uh, I think. Uh, do you have any r recordings out that people can, can hear? Yeah. If you go to actually, if you go to AdamWoodBand.com, I've got an album for sale, which is actually called the Grilled Cheese Album. I wrote a children's album in Seattle, um, and then there's also some other music. It links to. Uh, my, my MySpace page where you can check out the newer stuff. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. All right. 
Well, I think it might be time to hear one more song from Adam. What do you think? Yeah, yeah ladies and gentlemen, Adam Wood. Ready to go, ready to go. 